because they don't understand the language, they keep changing what things mean. For three years now, they've terrorized me with the fact that Kenneth pled principal, and that's the only reason I'm not in jail, is just because he pled principal. But now they're saying that his motion for principal was denied, which means there is no reason I'm not in jail other than the fact that I didn't commit any crimes, and they didn't find any crimes that I committed. That clears me. That literally clears me. For three years, you have all made it sound like I committed crimes and the court put them on somebody else who forced me to do it. And that was why I was free. But that's not what happened if that motion was denied. That's what they told me. Adonis Paul and Original Owl and Virgie G have gone over these records before and they said he pled principal. They made a big deal about the fact that he pled principal because to them it meant for a fact that I had committed crimes. Otherwise, he would have nothing to plead. But if he didn't plead principal, then I didn't do anything. He's not taking my crimes. I simply didn't do anything. They are insisting they want justice for somebody who they cannot even respect as a human. Roberta Laws had cerebral palsy. That is why they are marketing her as a potato and that she was murdered. That's why they sell her as a pile of dirt and a shovel. She was a woman and that's why Original Owl is showing her vagina and saying, Roberta Laws, give money. Look, here's my pussy, give me money. I'm pretending to be a justice, social justice warrior. I'm pretending to be desperately wanting justice for this woman that I'm calling a potato and trying to make money off of. Give me money. Roberta Laws was a human. She was a human being and she had cerebral palsy and she was murdered by a man who buried her in the backyard. And now 15 years later, these YouTube channels are profiting off of her death, mocking her death, mocking her, calling her a potato, making all of this merchandise to profit off of her name and telling themselves that they're good people. They're the ones that are right. They're the ones that want justice. As they make more t-shirts calling a disabled dead woman a buried potato. And one day people will see this. Because I'm not deleting it. 50 years from now, your children will know that you once made a crap ton of money mocking a disabled murdered woman. Just because she had nobody in this world. That would stand up for her as you did this over and over and over again. You need money. That's on you. But you're pretending to try to get justice for somebody you have absolutely no respect for. Which makes sense because you have no respect for yourself. So why don't you use yourself instead of using a poor, disabled, dead woman who did nothing to you but be murdered in a way that you found entertaining and profitable. Imagine being murdered and, find, and 20 years later, people are profiting off of it because everybody in this world is so hateful and cruel and ugly that we can't even allow the dead to just be dead. We have to take them and use them. Shove them in people's faces. Here, give me money and I'll take this corpse out of your face. That's how America is now, right? Fuck you. Fuck you and fuck everybody that thinks that way. You're damned right Roberta Laws deserves justice because these YouTubers that are using her name right now are creating a foul injustice against her. That nobody can do anything about because she was alone in this world and the only way anybody could say anything would be for them to be related to her. She doesn't have anybody. That's why they're allowed to do this. I don't have anybody. 
That's why they're allowed to do this. But the difference is she can't speak out and I can. And I will. For the rest of my life, I will let the world know that this has happened. That these cyberbullying YouTube channels have profited and mocked a dead woman. And got away with it for three years. And you're probably going to get away with it for another three. And another three. But I'm going to keep talking about it. Because fuck you.